Hello everyone, Dio here, and allow me to introduce myself. I am someone who has been collecting VHS and physical media in general for a long time now. More than a few years. And I have learned quite a bit about the game and the secondhand market since I have started doing this. And what I have learned overall is that it is a fucking scam. Do not trust a lot of the people telling you, oh, your old Disney tapes are worth thousands of dollars. I think I will show, or at least try to show in this video, why that is not the case. So, first, let's start with a conversation on artificial scarcity. If you don't know what artificial scarcity is, it is an economic thing where a company produces items of a limited qual, intentionally produces items of a limited quantity and intentionally sells it for a limited time so that company can give off the illusion that the item is scarce even though in reality it is not. How this ties into Disney tapes as it has also tied into things like Funko Pops and Beanie Babies and other such items, is that you may have seen the commercials as a kid of buy this Disney movie now on DVD or VHS, or we will put it in the Disney vault and you won't be able to buy it again for a decade. This was an intentional tactic by Disney to get you to buy these tapes and DVDs to so you can get them before you can't get them anymore. And there's a great video by Yesterworld Entertainment that I will link in the description that goes into the kind of manipulative tactics that Disney used to advertise this vault. But short story is is that they would you know, hype these DVDs and VHS tapes as being limited time only. You could only get it for a few months or it'd be gone forever. And you may ask me, hey, Dio, why does that matter? As long as it's scarce, then it is sells for pretty well, right? No, not really. eBay listings you may see may prove otherwise. You may see eBay listings that say that the tape or whatever is a thousand bucks, hundreds of bucks, you know, whatever. That's what you may see. The reality is, and you can do this yourself if you have the time, go to any Goodwill in America and you will find pretty much any Disney tape from the early 90s to the early 2000s that you can think of for a quarter Half a dollar. Maybe a dollar at the most expensive. The point being is that even though Disney were like, get this for a limited time only, they still produced millions of these things and were still in houses all over America and were still being sold in used DVD and VHS stores everywhere. And a lot of people also just stole them from rental stores, but that's a conversation for a different day. So, to elucidate this point, I have here something that a lot of these collectors might cream their pants over. The Black Diamond Beauty and the Beast in pretty good condition. Pretty solid condition. There is some writing with a sharpie and a sticker on the on the tape on the box but besides that it is in good condition so what's the problem you, good job good job you got you got the expensive tape for, for for free in somebody's box in their garage you should sell it for a million dollars or whatever that's what i would say too if in worse condition, sure, but I got this at Goodwill for 
a quarter. Because that's how much my local Goodwill sold these VHS tapes for. This was before inflation really fucked us all in the ass, so it might it may have gone up since then. But here is another Black Diamond Beauty and the Beast. Sure, in much worse condition. The plastic you don't have to be a collector to tell the plastic is literally fucking peeling off. But the tape itself is in pretty good condition. The thing is, is that I stumbled upon both of these. Both of those. Both of those I stumbled upon. If you can just, like, randomly stumble upon shit, it's not that rare. Especially multiple of them. No, it's not that rare. Just to really hammer this point home. Aladdin 2, The Return of Jafar. Might be a similar story if you look on eBay or another secondhand selling site. You may see this for 50 100 bucks, maybe even up to a thousand. Here's another one in almost identical condition. Almost identical condition to the one I just showed you. That I just stumbled upon. Just, someone was like, here, Dio, have a box of VHS tapes. We heard you like VHS tapes, here's a box of them. Only issue is... There's two of them. And I'm not the kind of person to have multiple tapes in one thing. I'll usually just keep them in a bin. Here's another one that's really sought after. Is Lion King, the Masterpiece Collection. If you don't know what I'm talking about when I say Masterpiece Collection or Black Diamond, that's just different eras of, of Disney VHS tapes. Just to clarify. So here's one. There's a little... I'm not sure if you can see it, but there is a little dent here in the clamshell. One, a Tahu, three, three Lion King Masterpiece Collections. All I just fucking happened upon. I don't know if it was some miracle of fucking serendipity, or are these tapes really just super common, and are you being scammed? I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope you have a good rest of your day.